Well, Brent, the only reason that pig might be happy is the fact that he's not part of the tailgate celebration here as we kick off the 1995 season for Penn State. Now, they haven't stopped celebrating out here for 17 consecutive games. They hold the Division 1A record. But the most important thing to remember is last year they finished second to Nebraska in the poll, but not according to the signs that are posted out here. They say that Penn State was number one. In fact, the Nittany Lions went so far as to fashion their own championship ring. The teammates from that team wear them proudly. And today, they set their sights on the legitimate number one for 1996. ABC Sports welcomes you to college football. A CFA matchup from out of the Southwest Conference. The Red Raiders of Texas Tech take on the defending Big Ten champion, the Nittany Lions of Penn State. Before 96,000, Penn State will attempt to win for the 18th straight tie. Fishes dashes in off the bench, number 83. He'll line up to the right, and Ingram sits down on second and 10. In the round, fumble! Ball, the Red Raiders That's storm on it for a touchdown. The Red Raiders have scored a touchdown with Sean Banks of Dallas recovering the fumble on the end around in the end zone. A very dangerous part of the field to call that play. <laughs> Joe says, I can't believe it. Effort by Thomas. He was sealed up on a block. He rolled around to make the stop. Now Richardson passing complete to Scott. Another first down for the Nittany Lions at the Texas Tech 31. Full house time. They put an extra blocker back in. Now the wing look off of that formation. The two fullbacks are the setbacks. And Whitman first down, Nittany Lions. First down, ball just inside the Red Raiders. 20-yard line, and Richardson again going to try to put it up under pressure. Jump ball. Complete penalty flag at the three-yard line. Freddie Scott, the receiver, and the penalty flag was thrown. He was on that left wing to help with the blocking and bring him in motion. Whitman to the end zone. So after giving up an early touchdown, the Nittany Lions march right down the field. Sassi will put the ball down. has a good leg. It may be off to the left. Kicker's left, it was. Conway misfires on the 49-yarder. Number four. Debbie is going down at the 21 with Killens all over him. That's the second time he's been in their face. A much better defensive football team than they were last year. They're proving it now. Ingram is back. He's got it at the 37. Come The Raiders have got it. No, still loose, still loose. Now the Red Raiders may have recovered it at the 20. That's the signal. 20-yard line. There's a fake to Hansburg. Lethbridge rolling right. Fires in zone. Snowball touchdown. Red Raiders lead it. Standing back in the Nittany line, 20. Texas Tech leading Penn State by seven. Ingram for the 23. Slashes back, comes free. 35, Ingram to the 40. And down at the football. Oh, ball's down, and the Red Raiders pounce again. They've got it. They take it away from Ingram, his second. Leading it by seven. They're having a hard time getting lined up properly. In trouble, throws it, Hansburg makes a move, touchdown, Red Raiders! Make it 21 to 7. And he misses an extra point. Oh, how that can come back to haunt you. Wow. Oh, baby. It's a small thing right now, but it can become a huge albatross by the fourth quarter. Penn State seven. Four wide receivers. A bridge can't find one open. And he's going down on the seven yard line with Brandon Noble on him. And it's three and out after a huge loss. Goal for the Nittany Lions. This ball is gonna be put down at the 27 yard line. 
37 yard field goal attempt for Conway. No good. So the Red Raiders hold off the first drive of the second half. Hope to be able to keep him from running, but a lot of his running is in the scramble situation. And first, looking to get the corner. First and goal on the Hansford fumble. Terry Sloan on the left side of the formation. They run to the other side. Touchdown, Penn State on the Whitman run. Milne and Archie are in the backfield. Scott and Ingram are the wide receivers. On a short drop, quick drop, Ingram grabs it. Fumble! He's down. He's down. And they mark it down right there. First down. Another. Fake this time. Richardson now sideline. Ingram's got it out of bounds at the 11-yard line. Remember, this series began at the Red Raider 11-yard line. Now on third down. Scott is slotted. Richardson rolls to his direction. Throws Ingram. They mark it on the three-yard line. Bobby Ingram making a spectacular grab as he goes out of bounds at the three, but short of the first down. They elect to go for the touchdown in the lead. Pass up the field goal from the right hash mark, and they're going to throw for it. They got it to the tight end, Keith Olsummer. And this game is tied, pending the outcome of the extra point. Third down. Lethbridge, receiver covered, now under pressure. Got an open man, Mitchell. Far side, Mitchell. Out of bounds at the 40-yard line of the Nittany Lions. Meanwhile, there's a freshman kicker down there for the Red Raiders. Might be getting a little nervous right now. Here's Hansford, left side. Hansford found the corner. 42-yarder, he was 5 for 5 last year from this distance. Did Brad not miss one. Spinks will snap at the Scoville. On its way, Kirby got it. The Red Raiders back into the lead. They're rushing up inside, they better pick it up. Richardson under pressure, caught by Ingram, and that at the 34, first down, Nittany line. Down again. Big play for both squads. Richardson off a of fake. In trouble now. Slows got him again. Tremendous. 19-yard line, and it's number 10, Mr. Ingram. Joe Nastasi. Never will put it game. down. He'll be the holder for Conway. It's going to be from that right hash mark. Kicker's right hash mark. 39-yarder, and everybody's up in Happy Valley. Will it still be happy in a few seconds? You've got a great view at home. Here it is. Conway has given the lead. Back to Penn State. And baby, it was close. Last snap of what has been a heck of a college football game. Complete and down at the 45. And Texas Tech goes out badly. They lose it, but they did not back away. A three touchdown underdog. And Joe Paterno is over here to say, hey, that's a heck of a football game. I am just lucky to get out of here alive. The Nittany Lions win their opener, but only by a point as the Red Raiders miss an extra point. And Conway hits the big field goal. Don't forget next.